Ron Lavin is a renowned energy healer and is the founder and director of One Light Healing Touch, an international energy healing and mystery school with locations in the United States and in Europe. Ron has participated in several healing studies with the National Institutes of Health and the landmark results have been reported in the Western Journal of Medicine and Time Magazine. The studies show that energy healing profoundly improves our overall physical and emotional health. His work is featured in the documentary, One Light Healing Touch. Healing is any action that creates greater communication between body and spirit, and conversely, anything that disturbs that communication creates disease or disharmony in the body. And so we're going to work with learning how to create harmony between body and spirit with a lot of different uh, practices and processes today. It is the, the energy of, of light that animates us. And so when we do healing work, we're just stepping in to that energy flow of light and into that flow of gravity. And so the energy comes down through the head, across, it flows down through the chest, through all of the energy centers, channels, organs, and out through the bottoms of the feet. It also, when it comes to the throat, it makes the turn and comes through the arms and hands. Uh, in many other spiritual traditions, it is taught that the arms and hands are an extension of the heart, that uh, it both brings the beauty and the intention of the heart out with the communication channels which come through the throat. And so the hands are instruments of expressing creativity and heartfelt intention. And when we do healing work, we are using our hands as the instrument of conveying that light moving through us to healing work with another, to share that light with another who is perhaps stuck, perhaps off balance, who has a particular disorder where the energy is not flowing. National media, including Geraldo, the reporters, as well as local news, and magazines such as Body, Mind and Spirit, and Omni have all focused on its extraordinary documented healing work. We're talking about something that supposedly everybody has the power to do. Call it hands-on healing, simply using the touch of a hand to make somebody feel better. But just relax and allow yourself to feel your spirit come up into every cell of the body. There's a, an understanding that something new is afoot in the world, and everybody wants to get on the cutting edge. I work hand in glove with doctors. The American Medical Association is the best in the world for acute medical care. When patients have their surgery, they then need uh, recovery, and hands-on healing is great for recovering and for prevention because it deals with bringing the person into alignment with himself. It's a landmark time in our ability to understand the healing process. That was wonderful. I feel so relaxed. I did feel the stress go away, and I felt other forces being put back in. It was, there were two different feelings I felt. Ron and his healing school have received high praise from students and medical professionals alike. If you want transformational personal growth or to be a hands-on healer, this is the place to go. And the teachings about the nature of human experience and our relationship to spirit is rock solid. You will never be bored. Halea priest, massage therapist and psychotherapist. We use a lot of techniques to get us into a place where we're really feeling in our bodies, grounded, and our energies are flowing. Centered. We're feeling 
we're feeling the energy of life moving through us. Yeah. That's essential as a healer. What I teach in the school as a prelude to these healing techniques is what I call the six sacred practices. And they are meditation, visualization, sound work, breath work, movement, and sacred ceremony. If you practice any one of these six sacred practices or a multiplicity of them, what happens is you begin to clear and ground yourself on a daily basis. And I teach what I call the nine point protocol. And this is a protocol that every healer in the school learns to do, to acknowledge the spirit of another, to invoke the creator spirit who actually does the healing. Sure. And to honor the person that you're working with in all ways mm -hmm. so that you don't invade their space or take their energy into your space. And yeah. many healing schools don't really address this, Ron, is what I have found. I haven't found it anywhere else. And I've, I've been in the, in the field for 30 years. I've worked in, in at least um, 15 different countries and um, have not seen it anywhere else. One Light Healing Touch schools are located in the Northeastern United States and in Europe. Certified instructors teach the 18-day basic training and Ron teaches both the master's level and the instructor's trainings. Ron Lavin and the One Light Healing Touch instructors are able to access high levels of healing energy as they teach over 33 dynamic techniques for healing oneself and others. The One Light Healing Touch material is drawn from holistic, shamanic, and esoteric traditions and is ideal for those seeking personal growth and change and all healthcare practitioners. Various newspapers have reported remarkable physical, emotional, and spiritual healings by participants in the trainings. From a dramatic lessening of pain and anxiety to the elimination of numerous diseases. The focus of One Light Healing Touch is to help heal our body, mind, and spirit, strengthen energetic flows, open intuition and creativity, support our spiritual evolution, and help empower us to live our purpose for being. I went to the doctor, I was having trouble with my shoulder. Terrible pain in my shoulder. And uh, she said it probably was the sinus. This is two weeks ago. And this morning, I hit the surgery and I cried. It's gone. It's unbelievable. I can't believe it myself.